Hi guys, what is up? So today we are going to be doing something very, very exciting. I am going to be doing my first ever, ah, like, sponsorship or whatever. This clothing company reached out to me and said I could pick three clothing items from their Halloween collection and I'm going to be trying them on and reviewing them today. I'm so excited. This is my total 100% honest thoughts. I've never bought anything from this company. I've never tried on anything, so this is going to be my first impressions. I have not even opened the bag yet, and it's been around here for like a week or so, so I'm very excited to finally open it. So, uh, I got two dresses and one costume, I believe, so I'm excited to try it on and tell you guys what I think. The company is called Miss Fox. I looked at their stuff. Um, it seems pretty reasonably priced. It doesn't seem like it's like a Wish or a Shein. It was pretty average prices. Um, you know that you pay at like Target, Walmart, whatever, but I just want to see and maybe hopefully um, it's going to be good quality and this will be a good place for you guys to shop for regular clothes, for Halloween clothes, for whatever, so I'm very excited. I also want to say, don't forget to subscribe to my channel, it's so exciting to see it grow, so I hope you enjoy these spooky videos that are going to be happening through the month of October, uh, so go ahead and give this video a like. A subscribe and follow me on my other social medias for more spooky and silly content as we go along. There's going to be so much happening in the month of October as far as videos and traveling and content and just things happening in general and I want to take you along with me. So without hesitation and my dying camera battery, let's get into this. It's already hot. Okay, so it looks like everything is individually um, wrapped in their own little packaging, so it is Miss Fox, and it's MissFoxShop.com. I love these little bags. I can already see the Halloween stuff. I'm so excited. We're going to save the costume for last, so let's go ahead and try on some of these very cute, apparently vintage, 50s style looking dresses. It's been so long since I did a haul or anything, and I'm so, so excited. Um, to try these on. Uh, the only thing I'm worried about is they only had a small, I think it was small, medium, large, and most clothes, as you know if you watched my uh, closet clean out, that I'm like an extra small, so I'm afraid these are not going to fit, which in that case, if you want these, you can have these. <laughs> um, but I will let you know the quality. So this one is um, a very cute dress with like skeletons and stuff on it. Uh, I like the print. It's kind of uh, cut to come down and go up and like look kind of spooky and creepy and I love that. Um, it has a zipper. Um, it feels kind of stretchy. Not super stretchy but definitely um, you could, I don't know, it just feels like comfortable material uh, from an, oh never mind, look, look at, that is a little stretchy. I'll just rip it. Um, okay, I like this so let's go ahead try this on and see if it fits. Okay, so here it is. Um, I'm going to try to put the camera down just a little, little bit so you can see. Um, yes, here it is. It is sadly too big for me. Uh, I don't know if you can tell, but um, around the waist, if I were to pull it, I can grab a handful of material and then it's now tight enough and then uh, I let it go and it gets a little, a little boxy for me. I am boxy, you see? That's not the company's fault. That's just... They don't have a smaller size, <laughs> and I need a smaller size. But I like how it's cut. It is very, it kind of, I don't know, it's like piratey. I don't know, this is not a pirate dress in any form or fashion, but I like the cut of it. I think it's very cool and spooky, and I like that it kind of shows some of your leg up here. I do enjoy that a whole, whole lot. Uh, and it doesn't, it's not uncomfortable. The material feels very light. So, I mean, maybe if it was like super cold or in the night in October, you might wear something underneath it or even over it. Um, the only thing I would say is that it's just not my size. I do like it. I like the pattern a whole lot. I like all the skeletons and the bones and all the creepy stuff that goes with my necklace. Just the downside of not fitting right, which has been a problem since I lost all the weight I did. So, I don't know. I like being ex an extra small. But some companies are like, no, you don't need an extra small, so we're just not going to make it. So, sad, sad. So, if I would say anything, I feel like this is going to be continued through the other two dresses and costumes. That expanding into an extra large and an extra small would be good uh, to just fit a wider variety of audiences because I've said this before I'm not the skinniest person in the world there's people much smaller than me I don't know where they find clothes <laughs> I have no clue how they shop so that's my only thing about this dress like I said it's very 
Um, I mean, I think originally, even though I got it free, I think it was only around, you know, $15, 20 That's not bad. That's an average price, probably what you pay at, like, Spirit Halloween for a Halloween dress or something. So I like it. I think it is very cute. I do wish it fit. I could maybe uh, put two, like, uh, put ties right here so I could just tie it in the back. Or I could even put, like, maybe a big, like, um, chunky studded belt, something also spooky, just to maybe make me be able to wear this um but i like it i'm not gonna get over this cut i think this cut is very cute i, I, I look i'm dancing i look crazy that's what i can do i can be those like skeletons in the graveyard that's what i am right now okay anyway let's look at the next thing and hope it fits okay so this next dress is actually a spiderweb one i got it because i just liked um, I like the dresses that kind of just don't have any shape sometimes because then I just feel more fashionable and something that's big and baggy and I'm like, Whoa. that's just how I feel. Uh, and I like the sleeves so much. Anything with crazy sleeves I'm going to love and enjoy and this has very big sleeves so I love it. I think um, the material on this is not stretchy. There is no give. I don't want to call it like umbrella material but it kind of feels like um, something you would wear like a really thin like sports material it does kind of feel like an umbrella not in a bad way just there's no stretch it's kind of thin so let's go ahead and try this on and hope it works a little better than the one that's currently on my body okay so here's this one like i said i like the sleeves i don't care what the rest looks like i could stand here and do this oh okay. i like the sleeves so much they're you know kind of see-through and I really enjoy that, just like a real spidey web. I like it a lot. Um, I don't love the fit. Um, so let me go back to just because I like this style of dress does not mean it fits me well. <laughs> it never fits me well. I hate slip dresses, even though they're so cute, they just don't work with my body type, and that makes me very sad. And this, even though it has sleeves, it's still kind of a slip style dress. Um, yeah, it's not bad. I mean, it's cute and it feels, I like that it's not very super heavy. It feels nice and flowy and I like it. It's really just the sizing. I think I wish, 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 wish so bad I could have got it extra small, but I do like this overall in general. Oh, I think there's some, I have some static cling going on out here. Look at the, I don't know. I don't know if it's the air or static. I don't know, but it's getting stuck to me, but that's okay. Uh, I do like it a lot. Um, I don't know. If you all have any suggestions on how I could make this look a little better, I know it's supposed to be, maybe it does look good. It's so hard to see myself in this little, in the viewfinder. I don't know. Um, I do like more like form-fitting things. If there's a way to form-fit the dress, but still keep the sleeves very long and cool, I think that would look really cool if the dress looked, you know, kind of like this. I think it would be really awesome, but I like it. I think it'd be just kind of a cool and casual Halloween look. Um, you know, if you have like Halloween, if you guys are back in the office and you have an office party, I think it would be cool, you know, to wear there. It is to the knees, so it's pretty, I mean, for a Halloween dress, if you want to come modestly, modestly, you can be modest in this dress because it's just, it feels very nice, it's very spooky, and I think it will make for a very cute um, Halloween dress, a Halloween themed dress for a party or for anything, or to just wear out and be extra spooky if you want. So the last thing I have is a uh, actual costume. I think I got a witch costume because I have a witch hat, so I'm very excited to try this on. Hopefully I can do a makeup look. If it fits right, I can do a makeup look to go with this and then put it on Instagram. I'm very, 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 very excited to try on this costume. So let's do that. She's a big one. Woo! Okay, so this is a lot of stuff. I would show you, but there's so much stuff, so I'm pretty sure. Okay, so there's a reference picture. Thank the Lord. So this is what I'm supposed to look like. So uh, the dress, the belt, and the hat, I believe I have, but I think I'm holding four things. Well, I don't know. But anyway. Okay, so I'm supposed to have, I'm supposed to look like this when I get done. So let me go see how close to this I can get. <laughs> I'm growing my brain, finally. <laughs> okay, I finally got it on after that whole thing. But look at this, look at this, look at this. I'm very excited. Oh, I love it. I love it so much. I love it so much. I, love I hope you run in the, into me in the middle of the woods. <laughs> you better hope you're not a boy or a child, because if you are, you're going to my pot. Nobody but girls are allowed to live around me. I love this. Oh my god, I love this so much. I actually have a hat that has like stars and stuff on it because this has stars and moons, and I have a witch hat that has stars and moons cut out around the brim. Oh, don't you think you're not gonna see me in this if you follow me on Instagram? 
Because you are. Oh, I'm so excited. Oh, look at this. Look at this. I love this so much. So basically how this works is there was four pieces. Um, the hat, the dress, the belt with this little moon that you put on yourself, and then there is um, the stars and the moon. This is a sheer thing. And then it comes with this very long black one-piece dress. And then you put the sheer, um, <coughs> and then you put the sheer star and moon dress over it. And then it looks like, um, the little witch in the picture. And it looks just like it. I look, this is me, except I don't have my broom. Um, I bought a broom for pictures and I lost the broom and I don't know where the broom is at. But that's the story of my life. Ah, uh, look at these sleeves. Look at these leaves! I love this so much. I'm not gonna get over this. So I think I like this because um, at first, before you put the belt on, the dress is very, it's very one, you know, just kind of like the, um, kind of like the spiderweb dress. It was just very plain, very straight. There was no shape to it. But then when you add this belt and you have the little moon, it makes such a huge difference. It gives you a shape to the dress. It gives your body some shape, and it just really pulls everything together. And I'm not gonna stop doing this and I love it. I'm so excited. Oh my gosh. I love this so much. I'm telling you, you don't understand how many pictures I'm going to take in this thing right here. I'm so dang happy. Uh, yeah, so I'm very excited that I got this. Uh, this is definitely my favorite thing. I should have got more costumes, but um, I really love dressing spooky around Halloween, so I wanted to try to get some dresses that... Um, I could wear and take very cute pictures and spooky pictures and without being in full-on costume. But I'm so happy I bought this. I like it so much. Look at my hat. Look at my hat. Look at me. Look at everything. I love it so much. So um, if you are and want to buy from this company, I will link them down below. But also just kind of keep in mind, well, first of all, how happy I got when I tried this on versus my reaction for the dresses. I'm not saying the dresses are bad. If you are actually a small to medium, I think you're going to be much safer than I am being as small as I am. Sadly, like I said, that has been the downside to losing the weight. Um, most smalls, no matter what company, just don't fit me. Um, and how my body is shaped. So if you are actually a small, I think to medium, I think these dresses would be perfect for you. So if if anyone wants these two, you can have them. You can totally have them because they're very cute and I don't want them to go to waste. They just don't fit my body. I think they're very comfortable and they feel very good and they feel very loose and very flowy and they just feel very good. So I'm so, so happy. This just makes me even more happy for spooky season. I'm so happy October is here. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. Anyways, so oh, I think that's going to do it for this one. Uh, I just want to say thank you so much to Miss Fox for uh, sponsoring this and sending me this clothes to review. Um, if you're watching, the only thing I would say is in the future, just consider expanding your sizing options because I would love, love, love to be able to have gotten those dresses and being able to actually wear them and have them fit my body. That would have been so exciting because they're very cute and very comfortable dresses that I would love to actually wear. But this costume, I love this so much. I'm not going to get over this. Like, I love this. I can't stop swinging my witch wings around. I love this so much. So anyways, my final thoughts, like I said, is um, I think if you are not an extra small and you're not a very small person, or if you know how to um, sew dresses and, what is the word? Alternate? Is that the word? Am I, am I just dumb? Clothing alterations. Yeah, if you know how to alter a dress uh, and clothes and please go ahead and consider buying them because they're very cute. Uh, this costume on the other hand we needs no alterations. It's very amazing. I'm so happy if I haven't got that cross. I'd be a hundred times upset it. I love this so so much. So please consider going and checking out Miss Foss and all their really cute and amazing Halloween selection. There's so many cute things I wish I could have got. It was so hard picking. They had a lot of awesome dresses I wanted to try, but that's going to do it. I have so many very fun videos coming up for October that I'm so excited to share with you guys. Let me know if you have any video suggestions down in the comments below and stay safe in this spooky season. Bye! What? Are you eating something you shouldn't be eating? Yes. Yes. <laughs> I love it. I love it. I love this.